They could play Life is Strange. Oh, is that like parts five that. part yeah. thing? Alex, that's Alex, Alex requests that for the channel in general. Four. Does it even say that? Yes, actually it does. I just, oh. That's why I double check them, because we found something weird in the options. Oh, your that, controls, yeah. right? Okay. Well, no, we wanted, first we wanted to make sure that the screen was full. And then the other thing was that we want type 2, where I aim with the left trigger and fire with the right trigger. Oh, yeah, because there's no... That's right, because you don't aim with the right stick or whatever, isn't it? Just like, mm -hmm. you aim with and move with the same stick, isn't it? Yes. Because this was on the GameCube. Yep, so, so hello everyone, we're back for more Let Us Play Resident Evil 4, and this time we've got Matt playing with... Aaron here watching and... And Josh spectating the death. Mm -hmm. There could be death. This is one of my, my probably my favorite Resident Evil game. It doesn't mean I'm the best at it. Well, I, I mean, this was, you know, they say you always Resident remember your first. Evil. This was his indoctrination into... Into the world. And this is, this, this uh, begins the good Resident Evil games. It was the year when those grisly murders occurred in the Arklay Mountains. Soon after, the news was out to the whole world, revealing that it was the fault of a secret viral experiment conducted by the international pharmaceutical enterprise, Umbrella. <laughs> the virus broke out in a nearby mountain community, Raccoon City, and hit the peaceful little town with a devastating blow crippling its very foundation. I know, because I was there. Not taking any chances? The President of the United States ordered a contingency to plan the to council. sterilize Raccoon City. The President and the Federal Council. With the whole affair gone public. <laughs> wow, the they actually States used the all they actually used indefinite all the suspension old of business decree to umbrella. Soon its stock prices crashed, and for all intents and purposes, Umbrella was finished. So by the way, this is the first last that you'll hear of like the plot proper until you get like to Wesker whatever that is six years have passed since that horrendous incident because the plot of this game has really nothing to do with I received special training via a secret organization working under the direct control of the president I was to assume the responsibility of protecting the new best. president's family Cornel. Why am I the one who always gets the short end of the stick? Yo, who are you really? Come on and tell us. Let us talk in these American colloquialisms so the dumb American can understand us. You have my sympathies. Guess that's a local's way of breaking the ice. Anyway, you know what this is all about. My assignment is to search for the president's missing daughter. What? All by yourself? <laughs> I'm sure you boys didn't just tag along so we could sing Kumbaya together at some Boy Scout bonfire. His ear looks yeah. really funky. Maybe you did. <laughs> yes, it does. <laughs> oh, you crazy American. It's a direct order from the chief himself. I tell you, it's no picnic. I'm counting on you guys. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, no. Let's see how long that lasts. Mm -hmm. I remember being like scolded for calling this like some third world country and I think it was Paul who was like, they're in Spain. And I'm like, well they're not, not officially. It was right before I was to take on my duties of protecting the they're president's daughter. They're in a European country that speaks speak Spanish. Spanish. That's the ultimate There's reason only I'm in this one of lonely those. <laughs> rural part of Europe. According to our intelligence, there's reliable information Spain about a city of a girl that looks very similar to the president's daughter. Spangical? Apparently, she's being withheld by some unidentified group of people. Spans. Who would have thought that my first Spain job would have been a rescue mission? How about Frain? <laughs> Spittily. Spain. Spittily. 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 Policia! This is an horror movie, isn't it? 
Imagination. Actually, uh, the fog is actually there. Sorry it took so long. Oh, they drive on the... Oh, that's right. I think there's only actually like two or three countries that drive on the... that have their steering on the, the right side. I think it's like England and Australia and maybe like one other country. Everybody else actually drives on... <laughs> Same side that we do. You just said like two different things. I no, I'm no drivers. like what? Well, no, because if your steering wheel is on the right, you don't drive on the right side of the road. You drive on the other. You drive on the other way. Cool. If you went to one of the other countries that drive on the other side, just up ahead the is the same bridge. way you can buy cars here that have steering on the other side. If you really Which is a very poor around. idea, I would think. We'll stay and watch that car. It's not really any tickets. Don't want to get any parking tickets. Right. Parking tickets. Good luck. It's a police vehicle. Don't you have like some sort of like hang tag? Well, it's not because they're just pussies or anything. Did you say something? Yes. Did you call me a name? Ah, yes. Leon, I hope you can hear me. I'm Ingrid Hunnigan. I'll be your support on this mission. Loud and clear. Somehow I thought you'd be a little older. So the subject's name's Ashley Graham, right? That's right. She's the daughter of the president. So try to behave yourself, okay? <laughs> Whoever this group is, they sure picked the wrong girl to kidnap. I just like these, like, attempt I'll try codec. to find some more information on my <laughs> end as well. Good. Talk to you later. Leon out. And I like the, uh... I the should I check that file out. I like how he needs to be reminded which is his outgoing image and which is hers incoming. <laughs> yes. So right now I have a pistol. Ooh, a standard nine millimeter handgun. It's pretty. Does it have stars carved into it? No, but it should. It is colloquially known as the Silver Ghost. I, I gotta remember all the uh, shortcuts for picking things up. Triangle. Got to get organized. Oh yeah, that's right. Your inventory. You play Tetris. Yeah. All good inventory is based on Tetris. Sure. <laughs> now let's check. That file. Oh, I thought she was younger than that. Oh no, dude. It looks like every other meadow. <laughs> It'll be tough to find. But yeah, I don't know how they know it's an insider, but there is one. Do they ever reveal who that is? It was a Krauser? Yeah. That's the assumption, anyway. So, he decided to go rogue with this kidnapping instead of... I thought he, like, a long went rogue. Well, he faked his death and then used the knowledge he had well, to... Well, he's not an insider, then. Because <laughs> they didn't... He's not actually working with them anymore. He's not an insider, he's a traitor. And supposedly the only reason Leon was assigned to this is because he was so busy training at the time that, uh... Alright, let's get the control. Walk, look around, aim, fire, I want to actually fire, and knife. Oh, uh, yeah. Huh. Forget your makeup or something? Yep. Yeah, no subtitles? We have no, to turn that on? I don't think I can. There, There was no setting for it. Huh, that's helpful. Okie doke. Let's get out of here quick. Oh, this popsicle stand. Not that way, cowboy. Dang, I'm trapped. And he'll just say the same thing over and over. I can't remember. Does he say something different if you come to his side? <laughs> What's the matter? Did you lose your nerve? Oh. Yeah, it's fucking great for you to say that. Time to go. Uh, it's all looking for familiar. Now. Like you've seen this before? Pretty recently. Pueblo. Must mean house. A village. Mm. <laughs> that really deep <laughs> voice they yell everything in. Not for long. Quick turn. I hope I can find somebody to... I really hope the person who lives in this house is nice and speaks American. Not English. <laughs> I 
Leon is very observant. Just walked in a dude's house. With a gun. Uh, excuse me. Sir? Paul Mercier. Shoot him. In the head! <laughs> Later. I was wondering if he might recognize a girl in this photograph. Does that say him? <laughs> Sorry to have bothered you. He seemed okay for a minute, though. <laughs> Why are you taking your hands off the controls, dude? You know this Freeze. is the game that you can't do that. <laughs> I knew I, I knew I could then. Ah, you dog. <laughs> He's gonna block. Ha! So he's gonna block your bullet with with the axe and his hand. Oh yeah, this fun bullshit. Shit. Foul language, Leon. No time. <laughs> yes, sir. It's just plenty of time. Is everything okay? No. There was a hostile local. I had no choice but to neutralize him. There are still others surrounding the area. Get out of there and head toward the village. Take whatever measures necessary to save the subject. Understood. He's not a zombie. In case you weren't sure. Because I have about some items, Leon. I have time to check all this. It's a fire in you know, a wood. Hey, there we go. Totally. You know all that momentum you had while you were standing still? Ow. Alright, we're getting there. Oh, you're still alive. You're not. Come here, buddy boy. My favorite, the music ending. Ah, yes, pesetas. Pure gold. What? Pesetas. Yeah? <laughs> Apparently. Yeah, good thing you need so much of it. Ah, really? What a chip. Is there usually something there? Yes. And just because I can. <laughs> That was fun. Let's go find that dog. No, but what about the poor police officers I came with? They're gone, aren't they? Oh, no. I'm sure you're beat up about it. Where are the officers? Probably pretty dead. No, I bet they didn't. Oh, and, and somehow that took out the bridge. So, this means I am now... Stuck. Yep. And the only way out is to find the President's daughter and complete my mission. Are you badass enough? Am I a bad enough dude to rescue the President's daughter? Oh, we have to throw something old Resident Evil in here. What about typewriters? Well, you don't need ink ribbons, but there's still typewriters. And herbs. Don't forget about herbs. First save point of the game! Hey, we didn't have to access a hard disk on the GameCube. Good thing we're... Whoa. 
There's your typing. Puppy, puppy, puppy. I'm getting to the puppy. Hold on. No. Do they just give you money? Yes. I tend to prefer bullets to money. Oh, look at the poor little doggy. Your hands were like hovering over it. Yeah, I don't think a dog would just no way run back. away like that. <laughs> wow, you stopped that one short. <laughs> I learned my lesson from last time. Oh yeah, you got stuck in that one. <sighs> Great. In case you forgot where we were going. Oh, look at there. Ah, the villagers know how to use dynamite. Wow, that was really bad audio. Here, buddy boy. That's right, come right through. Ooh, uh. Does it say Red Hawk? Yes, I think. Yep, and this is when they start actually assigning brands to everything. Red Hawk 9mm rounds. And then I think the shotgun shells are like bear rounds or something like that. They're like all, they've all got like an animal theme. The uh, machine gun is like got a wolf. Instead of in Code Veronica where it was the handgun bullets that were the wolf. Yeah. Is this where we just were? No. Oh no, there's this dude. No, not this one. Oh, okay. I hope you don't mess your six inventory slots, Leon. Oh, I won't. Oh. <laughs> oh, hey there, lady. Roman's bad audio. Why the hell aren't they like giving you a prompt? Because I didn't hit them at exactly the right spot. Did you give me anything? No. Nope. Yeah, cut the bridge down. <laughs> yeah, about that. I oh, it's a pre-canned animation. Yeah. I was going to say, I could shoot them, but it won't do any good. And the funny part is, if you do a New Game Plus, where you, you can restart with all your items, those guys won't be there, because they don't want you to try to snipe them. Oh, this is the dude. There you go, this right? This is the there. guy that I was trying to shoot through the... There you go. Dang. I always do that. Problem is... Leon's not the most stable shot. Come on. Jip. Wow, he's like perfectly content looking too. I'm so happy you shot me. Then <laughs> <laughs> uh. those bullets are just floating there. Those are those rare Spanish floating bullets. Mm-hmm. Uh, are they a diver derivation of the Mexican jumping beans? Yeah. The Spanish floating bullet. Not now! <laughs> Leon, how you holding up? Bad question, Hunnigan. Sorry to hear that. I'm sending you a playing manual. It sucks he Hope only... It useful. I'll take a look at it, thanks. He only did this one game, I think. He also did the CG movie. The first one. Yes. Reload with X. Kick. That looks awesome. Oh, with that. <laughs> the picture. <laughs> He's like leaping at Yeah, him. but the dude's like... <laughs> Great. Yeah, we know that. That was so helpful. Thank you, Hunnigan. I didn't even bother to read the first one. So are they going to fuck or what? 
Are there any rumblings of that? They hit on each other throughout this game, but... Whoa, what? My binoculars that I use once in the entire game. And it's gameplay, too. Oh, oh dude. About that officer. That's the fat one. Where's the nerd guy? Uh, I think he doesn't show up till later. So technically, I can try to sneak through here and do some stuff before they uh, notice. Yeah. Usually, I'm not very successful at it, but we'll give it a shot. Oh, there's an old dude. I thought there was other. Oh, I knew there was some health over here somewhere. Turn around again. Yeah. Look in there. Oh, I thought I saw something else. Never mind. Uh, Problem is they walk like that. Uh, yeah, they walk around so randomly that sometimes you. But just... they said something about the best deal. No, did you just say no? Turn around. Is this the doctor? No, no, oh, that's yet. with the shotgun. He doesn't show up until I go into the building with the shotgun. He shows up when I come in here. Yeah? No, they his guess I am for the trust. Who are these people? Where's the guy with only like 30 health in a hard game? Yeah, he's a little bit tougher in this one. Shit. Son of a. They just said they were gonna kill me. It's my job to make sure that doesn't happen. Time to go upstairs. As soon as I raid the ammo stores. Flash gold. Good thing they left ammo and money and everything else lying around. Sure. I will take the shotgun. I will take this grenade. I will take your money. Here's the shotgun shells, which this is low res, but it's got a bear. It's a bear. On it. Wow! Time to bring out the big guns. Not the grenade. Oh, here we go. I, now, I, I always wait until uh, chainsaw guys in there. Look at this nice shotgun, 12 gauge pump action. Don't leave home without it. Here, my guys. Uh, throw the grenade. Yes, like, I, I usually wait till I'm outside, because the shotgun actually has a really good, uh... Spray? Yeah. Uh, huh. Wave two incoming. Dang. Thank God. Yep, about that healing. Actually, at this point, a, a single herb almost heals me all the way. Are you dead yet? Yep, no. Still not dead yet? Uh oh, I kept the face. Still not dead. There we go. 
Oh, okay. Ladder? Or out here. Excuse me, pardon me. Bye. Get that big dick, what? The atrocity T is behind you. Usually they follow it with imbecile. <laughs> Get that. That was good. Dude. Huh. Oh, yeah. Oh, la campana. Es hora de rezar. Tenemos que irnos. Yeah, I played this game too much. <laughs> it was weird how you did it, like, exactly with it. Tenemos que irnos. Lord Sattler. English. We have some English now, all of a sudden. What's well, the guy's name? Yeah, but they wouldn't say Lord. True. Where's everyone going? Bingo? Indeed. Welcome to Resident Evil. Four. The game with two title screens. <laughs>